Hey everyone, Johnny Trek here, and today we are checking out Bloodland, a post climate change disaster strategy game where you are trying to rebuild human civilization after some grand chaos that happened. So, um, this is kind of my second time playing through this. Uh, the first time I'll kind of explain what happened. So, uh, we're gonna go with this people with, with this clan here they're essentially or oil rig oil rig drillers at one point so we'll do that um we're gonna do this one stick with this difficulty layer uh level begin and off we go so one so this game seems to be very easy to lose it seems like or get stuck if you don't go the right path um, that's kind of why this is my second time playing the game. And my little sweetheart Kitty sitting right next to me. Came and said hi. Okay, head needle. Don't rub against the microphone. Okay, so here we go. Right off the bat, we're going to go ahead and just do this to collect some food. Um, and then down here to click this rubble. So what you have is this search and explore. And you have this little radius. Um where you know you can go and pick up different honey don't, don't, don't play that uh different resources around the area so um so i grab that so you can see we have food uh we have wood there's something else here like these flowers i i assume that's like medicine is what i'm guessing um and then this stuff this recycled is, is rubble or what, what they call call rubble um so just it's just junk that they use laying around. So uh, we're gonna speed up time really quick. Grab all that. And then you know, kind of this little story that goes on with this. Um, right now it's saying, hey, we're hungry, you know. Yes. Uh, also when something like this happens, like, like that pops up, they save the game and the game kind of uh, freezes for a minute while it's uh, loading. So, okay, so I got food. Um, now they're saying to go recruit the people which are inside this house. Uh, so this is a abandoned building, there's people inside it as well as uh, supplies. What we can do is get somebody to go inside there, be like, hey, come join us. Um, in this case, they require a uh, certain amount of food, and this, which we have food. Oh, well, 40 food. So we got 40 food, we're good. All right, perfect. So, same time, what we're gonna do. Okay. Now I was like, okay, no. Can't try to build humanity, it's not easy. We need to get uh, stuff to use. Build up civilization to get to that point. So, what we can do is do this technology development system, uh, section. Uh, you start here with new start, and you kind of go around. Uh, we can get into technologies. In this case, we're going to start with the exploration to get this more storage. So we're going to grab that and we go to this little encampment and well, we can upgrade it, but we don't have the, the resources to do it yet. So uh, what we're going to do is find, so we can empty that, we can empty this to get uh, some storage as well. And then maybe grab this stuff down here too. Um, you also have certain resources that are locked. So, like, we have these trees, but we can't get wood until we unlock this extraction build, this logging hut. And that's what happened in my last game. I got I got to the point where, in order to build new building items, um, I could do this. Uh, I needed wood, and I couldn't build the hunters, the cap, ugh, the cabin log. <laughs> the logging hut because I didn't have the research points to do it and because of that I couldn't get any more wood so I just I got stuck there was literally nothing more I could do so this this time we're going to take it easy we're not going to go too crazy um okay so here is saying like hey you know research a tent which we're going to do now and go ahead and just build some stuff so right now we have 20 people each tent holds uh three people so what we're going to do is we're just going to build four tents right now that get us about 12 
uh, place, 12 spots for people to live. Okay. So now from here saying, okay, we need a, you know, reliable, steady supply of food and water. So what we're going to do, go back and develop it. We're going to research the rubbish section. And here we're going to do a sorting hut. This will allow us to grab rubble from piles, from big piles. Um, and then we also need, uh, what was it? Uh, these. So last time I went with the fishing dock as well as the hut and the still. Um, I'm just going to do the forager's hut as well as the water still for now. Um, you can do the fishing dock, but I might just leave that for the time being. If you ever do the fishing dock, you also need to go with the field kitchen. Because this gets fish, which is risky. Uh, so they can like, it's like they eat it raw. And they make some really bad sushi out of it. Um, and so you want to make sure it gets put into the kitchen to be prepared. So in this case, I'm going to skip that one for now. I'm going to hang it the forester's hut. Uh, we're going to place it right here between these two berries. And... The next thing we're going to do is... We're going to go over here. We're going to start you know, collecting a few things. As well as get through this fog of war we have right now. Let's go ahead and crank up the speed. Uh, people go over here to kind of show us what's going on. You got these signal flares which show like hey there's a new spot that opened up um we're gonna grab some more of this more of this rubble or rubbish or whatever they want to call it um okay then it's how much water can we hold only 85 at a time and we're losing 20 days so we're going ahead and grab we're gonna search that just to get the water um, I'm also going to pause this for a second. We're going to get this shorting cut so we can get these two piles of uh, rubber share. So we do this and we're going to crank it up. Oh, we're waiting. Up in the top left, you can see we have our resources. It tells you how much you can store, how much you can stay. Um, these are your research points, which you get from uh, old world relics is what they call it. That little green star you see. Um, influence, I don't know what that is yet. And then population, which is the total population we have. And how many idle people you have. So in this case, we have eight idle. Yes, I know we don't have any. We don't have any fresh water. So what we're going to do is now make some fresh water. We're going to put one here. And then do another one. Okay, we're going to put one now. Because we need the... Wait till we get some more uh, stuff or rubbish. So let's go ahead and just send people out to maybe grab some. Um, okay, nothing over here. Uh, actually, we can do those. Okay. Get that going. Get people to grab that stuff. Get the tents built. Get this built. Let's, okay. Oh, it was getting built. Okay, there we go. Now it's saying that we need a place for people to study, so since we need like a research section. So one thing I want to note is like we have like this whole area around us, which is really cool. Um, I don't know if all this places, all these are explorable. I don't think it is. I think this are just like background. I have stuff like this industrial chimney. Our power station hasn't been searched yet. So at some point, I assume we can get over there. Okay. Alright, so... Food, we're doing okay over here. Uh, food, we are losing 10 a day, so we probably want to grab... Um, you know the forge is hut. And we'll put it right... Let's put it right here between these two. Okay, so next thing is we can, oh, sorry, you go back to that. You need to get this, uh, I think it's development. Yeah, uh, 
Study. We need to get the study. Uh, we can't do it because we need wood. We need wood for that too. Okay, so let's go ahead and research that. And go ahead and get the study. I need to make sure I get this too. So, okay, we've got the study. So let's go ahead. Before we do, I want to grab another water still. Because we are definitely losing food per day and water per day. So let's just let's get that stuff set up and going. And then you got this little guy down here who likes to just talk. I don't care what he has to say. He can stop talking. I don't. He says like random things. Uh, homeless. Oh yeah, we have homeless people. So we'll build more tents. Um, once all this stuff is done. I really, really about to run out. Last time I played this week. That was not a problem. Okay. Unfortunately, you can't move these, right? You can only deconstruct or upgrade. Yeah. Oh, we have like a hundred. Okay, we, we, we'll, we'll, we'll be okay for now. So water, we should be in positive. Food. Definitely not on the positive. Uh, this is... Yeah, prepared food for these. Okay, whatever. Um, okay, so we see... Maybe we in the positive? I don't know. Let's go ahead and just grab some more. Or add it. And grab this. Okay, next thing is... Let's go ahead and grab some more uh, tents. So, go ahead and maybe do like four more. I think we have uh, three, six, nine. Yeah, actually, let's just let's do that to do three more. Um, what we should do is grab these. Go ahead and start searching those. So yeah, these, these are the those are the relics. You need those to search. Research points. Hey, okay. people should be happy. Um, you're saying like, oh. Are you really out of there? Oh, what's going on? Oh, eh. You're saying like, hey, our water filters are kind of crazy. Like, no, I need to take it out for a day to fix it. We'll go ahead and say yes on it. And just saying, okay, someone put the stuff inside it, so. But right now, it's okay, because we'll max out on water anyways, so. Um. Okay, so next, let's go ahead and build this study. Like that will go away. I also don't know if there's a way to uh, rotate. I couldn't find a way to rotate, so. Uh, we'll put this here. Okay. They're actually out of that. What we're gonna do is we can just counter this for now. We're gonna deconstruct. And we're going to build another boarding hut. Uh, can I place it down here to get access to you guys? No. Only make that one, yes, but. Yeah. Yeah, put this one over here. Okay. And go. Yes, there's no space for food or water. It's okay, I know. So now we have Robo again. So I don't know what's up with this, like... To just automatically replenish itself? I, I don't know. And it was gonna let it, ripple, gonna let it do its thing. Can I do night shift? No oh, night shift. No skilled workers. Okay. Uh, so we already got that wreckage. We can't clear it until we get the right tools. Can't do anything with this. All oh, these houses are okay. Oh, actually. Ooh, we haven't done this one yet. Let's hold off on that one for now. Okay. 
So now since we have have the collector over there, let's go ahead and get the thing set up. Wow, it was quick. Jeez. Okay. So in order to do this, we need three of these things. Uh, relics, which we only have two, so we can't do anything with it right now. So we're just going to hit OK. Um, and produce ten research points, which I can't get right now. Yeah, so there's no point, like, you can add somebody on here, but... Oh. Go ahead and just maybe take some of that out. So you can add the people here, but it just... I don't think it does anything. Because we don't... Oh. Oh, maybe you can... Oh, maybe this means you can only hold one at a time. I mean, you can only... Sorry, you can only hold up to three. Okay, I'm sorry. Maybe I saw that differently as in you needed three to get one point. Okay, well, let's see what happens. Oh, so one thing equals ten points. Okay, cool. Okay. So I got that. Um, so now I'm saying, like, hey, you no, know, you need to get specialized workers. They do certain things. So we'll be like, okay, we'll do that. So what are we going to do next? Um... So this is where I ran into the issue with first. So this is what I want to do. Um, I think it was development. We're going to get the logging first because I don't want to run out of wood, which I did last time. So it's still logging hut and we can probably clear all of this down. So we're going to put you here. In the meantime, let's go ahead and get a, another expedition out this way. So you can see what's going on. So we have one person who's making this. Um, this should pop us up to 10, right? Okay, well. You're waiting until the next day. I want to check. So it put us at 19, yeah. Let's, let's head back in. Um, let's go do this for just hut. The house, I mean, not the hut, the house. And then we also need to do the... Uh, get this as well. So, the... Um, allows new operation mode for steady. This allows again experience level. Oh, man. Okay, so we're going to hit yes on this. Uh... Academy. So we're going to do an academy here. Uh, been the most experienced, so this one is new. I didn't get to this part, so we're here to gain experience. Um, in this panel, you can choose operation mode. Each mode means different functions. Selecting one of them locks the other until the mode is changed again. So we're doing academy. Small space. A small place to collect, analyze, and archive old world knowledge. Uses this. Uh, Da, 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 da. Institute's currently operating as an academy. People will study books uh, to quickly gather experience. So we don't have any books right now. So I don't know what we're about to do with this. We'll do with that. And now we have the Voyager's hut. So what we're going to do is knock this down. Uh, we're going to maybe explore a little so you can see the out this blue outline means that's as far as we can search we can't go beyond that see cannot ex can't explore our side storage range so so eventually we're going to get this knocked down please And then we're going to do the Forager's house, if that would go away. Okay, so we have we have the wood. Don't quite have the rubbish yet. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going to talk to these people. People are ready to learn a new skill. 
Ooh, okay. Um, so this is new. I haven't seen this one yet. Clan people. How are we doing, anyways? Oh, that's good. Um, not quite sure what this is all about. Um, precision fortitude? Prove skill? Okay, we're gonna do fortitude. This skill lets you have people work more efficiently in jobs like catching fish for food, gathering rubble, mining, and foraging. So we're gonna improve that. Actually, I don't know where that even came from. I do look your people. Okay, I don't know. I don't know how to get back to that. Okay, and then... We need to fill this job. Oh. Yeah, we have enough water for them to come in. So that house gave us people. Okay, there we go. We can do for it fortitude now uh yeah so we can go ahead and get that out okay this is where i got stuck i, I got past the part where i got stuck on so fantastic good job everyone got past it uh so we i've learned this uh i've learned that this power plant has a experimental project joint venture between private and government uh so much military left over da 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 so this radio tower uh, some of the scouts that were sent there, the area, have yet to be found. They should have a radio receiver on them. So, um, Kini means long distance communication. So, explore the area. Uh, Kini means of long distance communication. So, I, at that point, I don't know what that's about. I think we need this. Um, I think there's, yeah, there's something in there we can use, so we're going to, oh, okay, let's go ahead and do that, um, move back to standard mode, let's throw somebody inside there, I like how it's at negative one, I think something's kind of ha crazy happened to that, oh yeah, we need more houses now too. So, let's go ahead and not do that. I'm going to not do that either. We're going to do tent. So, uh, we're going to do this here. And then let's maybe do like a tent here and here. Kind of get that mixed around. Okay. Uh, food and water. Probably need to expand our water. Food seems to be okay for now. Some more free space for water. Yeah, it's fine. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, let's take a look if there's anything we can do first. Um, survival, exploration, the radio tower, tower maybe. Oh, but we need the rubble. Okay, so yeah, we need this either way. So we we'll grab this. So, okay, yeah, we can't do anything more here, I assume, right? Like, it's, we don't have any relics. Okay. So let's go back to the academy and see what happens with this. Um. So, for this, we're going to need this radio tower, but I don't have the points to do that with right now. Um, the question is, how do we get long distance? It's like, no, it's like right there. But even then, I couldn't do long distance anyways, because, uh, and I think I need to go. I have things I can't get like with yet, so I think I need like a. I think a logging camp does that. 
survival? Creation, living. I have fine. Where do I get the rubble from? Can I can I just get the rubble now? Oh, I guess I can do rubble. Okay, we're gonna go here. Here. Can I just Sorting Lodge. I'm not by Sorting Lodge, so I need to put a I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that. I think by now I know which one I need to click. Last for faster collection and sorting of rubbers from lodges to Hmm. Oh, lo sorting lodge, I'm sorry. Okay, so at this point I'm kinda stuck. I don't know what to do next. Um I can't grab anything from here. Uh, and this is like something over here in this edge. Let's do that. Uh, sorry, do this. Maybe take a gander, gander, see this like something over here I can collect. Like maybe there's a boat of some kind. Doesn't seem like it. At this point, I'm not quite sure what to do. We don't have any more, uh... Can't make any more research. Uh, we've already collected everything around here. Oh, I guess we haven't collected that yet. I can't talk to them. What if I click on this? Yeah. So. So I don't know what you're supposed to do in this case. Um. Oh, the game saving. Okay, I don't know what to do with this case. In this case. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I think I figured out the issue. I can just build a new storage unit over here. Because you're kind of limited to how far your storage can go. I can just go over here and build a new storage unit. I did not even think about that. Okay, wow. Uh, that was just so dumb of me. Okay, anyways, uh, we're going to approach this. Um, ooh. okay, and we're going to search this one as well, so, uh, let's go ahead and grab that, um, what we're going to do is, let's get rid of, rid of those people, so, how many people do we have working, we got two, four, six, eight, two, four, six, eight, ten, uh, thirteen, plus, there's these people, so, 13, 21, okay, yeah, that seems about right, so, um, I'm gonna knock this down to, like, 6 on both of these. Ooh, encyclopedia entry. Uh, coronal mass ejection, a large eruption of magnetized plasma from the sun's outer, uh, most, atm outer, at sun's outer atmosphere, or corona, that propagates, uh, the deplur, the, the ejection is one of the main transient features of the sun. I see a meet driving the planetary shocks in solar wind and cause the most intense geomagnetic, geomagnetic storms on Earth. The main drivers of space weather, geomagnetic storms, uh, disturbances in a magnetic sphere, blah, 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 blah. Um, oh, okay. I don't know if that will talk up more about the story. So, okay. We got books. Um, can we not get... Unless... I thought we also got, uh, relics. We not get relics? Okay, let's, uh, oh no, we did, they just, okay. Yeah, 
we get somebody in there start looking at that. Um, we're going to search you and search you as well. And then we're going to go over here. Yeah, heavy workload. Eh, no, it is okay. Let's go ahead and throw somebody else in there too. Add two people. Get that going. Um. Okay, yeah. We'll get there. Okay. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and search this. Oh, okay. We hit the end. Okay. Well done, Survivor. Uh, we've continued to thrive for now. Thank you for playing. We hope to see you November 15th. Okay. I guess we've hit it. I guess. Okay. I thought there'd be more to it, but you know what? Can't. You know, don't want to get too much of a good, good thing. We're going to see. No, of course, we'll play when it comes out on the 15th, so. Thing. I was really hoping to get some more time out of it, but yeah, you know, it is what it is. Anyways, thank you everyone for joining me today. I had fun. I hope you did too. I will see you guys in the next episode. Have a good one.